Hello, 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 hello. Miss Daylight Clay in the kitchen today. And how are you doing today? I'm doing fine. Thank you so much for asking. And I'm in the kitchen making me a pot of greens and ham hocks, y'all. Yes, 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 yes. This is what I had a taste for today. I've been eating kind of, you know, shabby lately. I haven't been eating a lot of vegetables lately. And I need to. I love vegetables and vegetables are good for me. So I got this big pot of greens. Uh-oh, this big pot of greens on, y'all. And I got my ham hocks in there. See my ham hocks? I got, look at that big boy right there. If this thing don't get us. I got my ham hocks in there cooking. Yes, 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 my greens. And this is what I will be eating off all day. Uh, as much as I like, as often as I like. I got my cornbread over there on the side. Over there on the side, yes I do. The, some of the ham hocks and meat is falling off the bones. I'm gonna let it cook for about another another hour because I want them ham hocks to be tender and juicy. I got I got uh, jalapeno peppers and onions in my greens. Yes, 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 yes. And right here I got some baby carrots. I got some baby carrots right here with some butter, some nutmeg, and some cinnamon. This kind of remind me of the flavor of uh, sweet potatoes, but not so much. So this is what I'm going to have for dinner today. I thought about cooking some tilapia whole fish to go with this, but I don't want to do too much because I won't be eating all that food by myself. So anyway, y'all, this is what I'm cooking today. Those are my carrots. And here's my greens and my ham hocks. Okay, and I want to show you guys something else. Give me a minute. Last year, guys, I planted uh, a sunflower tree. And this is one I planted this year. This one is much bigger than the one last year. This bad boy is about seven feet tall. And it is so full and it is so beautiful. You know, and all I did was I put it in this little tree trunk like I did last year. Put it down in the bottom of that. Gave it some uh, protein and things like that. And this baby is so big. You can see the flowers is getting ready to bloom here. Uh, you can see the flowers is getting ready to bloom there. Uh, the flowers is getting ready to bloom there. The flowers are getting ready to bloom, y'all, all over the place. Yes, yes, yes. So this is the one that I planted this year. This is the sunflower plant that I planted this year. And like I say, it is so, so big and tall and it's full. And I just took some sunflower seeds from the last year's plant and I repot, replanted them in that same soil. And that's what I got. You see, the bees are busy. So I'm hoping that, you know, the flowers should be blooming next week. And I will show you when it's done. So in the meantime and in between time, thanks for watching. Bye for now.